Hey, guess what area I forgot to check when looking for the star piece? Well, it turns out that it's right in front of the guard all this time, so... Just want to get that out of the way, now let's continue on with the regularities. Okay, Gumbar, you can quit doing that. So, my game musicians, then we are back in Koopa Village. Ready to do more... Well, not exactly ready, but we're willing to take on more errands from this guy. Oh, what luck! Yes. I've been hearing people talk recently. Apparently, I'm not so popular. People are actually saying I'm cheap. Including me. The nerve! A long time ago, I used to be like you. And, uh, ass, and then ass, you know, ass. But, uh, can you believe ass? So I said, and then, you know, ass, completely unfair ass, ass, and, uh, so very rude ass to spite my ass, and finally ass. Hey, are you listening to me? Well, the upshot is I don't really need any help, except, you know, all those boos living in Boo Mansion. Well, one of them has no photo of my. Why would they keep an old photo of you? So, well, I'd like you to ask him if they give it back. Why? And if you don't mind, could you hurry up about it? You promise you'll go? Well, if a boo just came to you asking for one of your pictures, I mean, that's kind of what they call a keepsake, Koopa Coot. Uh, but whatever, though, let's just go back to Boo's Mansion. And we're back in the ghost house, and... Oh, yeah, we forgot there's a star piece here. Let's see if the panel is somewhere nearby. Is it under the staircase? Is it over here? I'm guessing it's, like, near the carpet. Let's see. Yeah, I think it's in the rug. Yeah, it's right here. <laughs> And that's pretty clever indeed. Now let's talk to this boo. Oh, hey, what well, can I boo for you? <laughs> Quit with the puns. An errand for Koopa Koot, huh? Too bad for you. Koopa Koot's been known to use people, you know. Yes, uh, I've already known that. His motto is, if it moves, use it until it drops. He got in a couple fights over his personality way back when. After one really bad one, he started traveling a lot. This is a photo of us from when he passed through these parts. So are you actually a former friend of his? Take this and say hello to Koopa Koop for me. Old photo. So maybe you died before... Koopa Koop actually met you again, I don't know. Apparently he wants us, though. So let's just... go back to the village. And we're back in this village, and don't get all stacky with me. Dazzle. Okay, here's the old photo, and... Great club and clubbers! I'm in awe of you, Mario! All the days of my youth, just look at me there, so young and vibrant. It was, uh, the suddenly cautious, uh, low, lovely, uh, the passion, uh, maddening, uh, stress of that, and I never looked back. Anyway, enough of that, take this as a talk of my thanks. Yeah. No wonder you're so cheap. Anyway, excuse me for just a few minutes until I actually get this straightened out. Okay, that was just worrying me a little bit. I think something is bumping against the dazzle and that's just causing the picture to get all stacky, so I had to do something to kind of deviate that out of the way, so there we go. Now let's... I don't know why we left the house because I do believe we have three more errands to go here. Okay, so let's just continue on. I really haven't had a tasty meal in a Goomba's age. Miss Tasty's pasta would really hit the spot right now. Did you have to toe down and have her whip a batch? Did you hear my belly grumble? I'm ravenous. Please hurry up. Please don't let me starve. Okay. Well, I could let you starve, but I'm not going to since you're an old man and I like helping elderly people. Helping elderly people. But anyway, yeah, for Koopa Pasta, I do believe it's a Koopa Leaf and dried pasta. So let's get a Koopa Leaf over here. Oh, yeah, you're in the third bush. I see. And now let's go 
to Droid Royale Boys to pick up some dry pasta and let's go our way to Taste Cheat. And we are back downtown and we have some inventory for Taste Cheat here. What you mean? Yes. Just for you, honey. You'll be fabulous. Just a moment. Tra -la 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 -la. Do we have something good here? Yeah. This recipe's not too bad. There it is. Yep, here is coupon. Now, I actually do. No, no, we're just with dry pasta. It would be spaghetti, but okay. Come back anytime, time, I look forward to it. Alrighty, let's go back to the village then. And we're back in the land of the Koopas, and we have here some Koopasta. I hope you're happy. Come with the parent Koopas in a man of action, Mario. This looks simply delicious. I swear nobody should cook this dish besides Taste Tea. She has perfected the recipe. It's a little token of my gratitude. Yeah, one coin just for that. Please have some harder ones. I hope this one's more challenging. I seem to have misplaced my glasses, which is vexing. I suppose I must have dropped them somewhere. I haven't gone beyond the borders of Cooper Village, so logic suggests that there's somewhere in the village. But you drop what you're doing and find them? I have your word, young fella. Okay, well. I guess for this one, I we have to. Oh, there's Chuck Quizmo. Let's. <laughs> Let's pardon the interruption and get on with him right now. Kawiz! Yes. Well then let's go to the question. Hopefully it's not a hard one. What color pants was Gumba King wearing? Oh pfft. Definitely red and white. Yes. Definitely not red and blue. I mean that just doesn't really suit well. Four. Wow, I really need to catch up with the questions. I mean, I need to go to foreign places just to find them. Anyway. Well, they can't be too far. Hopefully they're not in the same bush. That would just be kind of redundant. Mmm, I could believe. Didn't really need that. Don't tell me it's over here. No. Is, oh, okay, cool. Is it over here, or is it over here? Why is there a dried shroom in that bush? Oh, and there's the glasses. I'm not gonna step on them like in the second game. Glasses, Cooper, Coop, drop. Deliver them. Okay. That I shall. Considering that the picture does not get all set, key on me. I am keeping close watch on you. Now okay, here's the glasses. Helping hurt plant? What is a hurt plant? You're a master sleuth, Mario. My eyes have surely gone downhill these last years. Now I can once again read books without any trouble. Um, having you been doing that already? Technology's great, isn't it? Yeah, still for one coin. Please, please have something good. I've really been drinking my show recently. I need a tart pick-me-up. Let's see. Oh, I know. A fresh lime should do the trick. Can you go find one? Hurry up if you could. I feel as slow as a tortoise. Do you promise? Okay. I know exactly where to get a lime, so... Be there in just a few minutes. And we are in the oasis. With a lemon tree and a lime tree. And I do believe, if I remember correctly, this is the lime tree. Yes, it is. Now that we have that out of the way, let us go back to greener pastures. And we are back in Kuba Koot's old bachelor pad, and let us give him back the lime. Yes. The spiny spikes! Are you for real, Mario? Mind-blowing! Crazy! Mmm, yeah! What a sour lamb! I'll put a spring in my step! I'm a spring! Rooster again! You're a stand-up guy for doing an old Koopa so many favors! This time I'll give you- Thank you, it's about time. Uh, that's not about time, but uh, I'll take it. So, I guess for now... 
I actually have time for doing one more thing before we wrap up the episode. So let us go back to Toe Town, the Toe Town port. And we are back in the Toe Town port and you realize that this place we haven't exactly been to yet. I mean, we haven't exactly talked to the people here. Get some good exciting information. Yeah, here's the bartender and the, I do believe that's the waiter. Yep. How are, who are these two? Hmm, hi, I'm Chanterelle. I'm I'm known around here as the pop diva of Toe Town. Oh, I used to be able to sing any note perfectly, each note a masterpiece. Those times are behind me now, perhaps forever. The sight of Peach's castle flying high into the sky was such a shock it caused me trauma. I haven't been able to sing since then. And now, now I'm a pop diva who cannot sing. A diva, excuse me. Oh jeez, cruel irony, isn't it? Yeah, it's it's definitely Diva, it's not Diva. I'm I'm just I'm just gonna call you Simone. <laughs> no never mind. I'm Simon, I'm Ramen. The folks who know it, I'm the master poet. Poor Pop Diva I cannot sing, but my lyrics are just a thing. My lyrics really rock. Pop Diva will be cured of shock. I'm tragically stuck though. Cause my last line's a no show. Later, Pluminator. Oh. Oh, so I guess what we need to do is look for a far away composer who can actually compose the harmony so that well actually no the har the harmony is the lyrics while the melody itself is the instrumentation the ensemble so what we need to do is what we need to do here is look for a person who can actually write up some some ensemble instrumentation to actually make the pop diva sing once more and I do believe I do know where exactly that said person lives so I'll be back there in just a few minutes and we're back in Droidory Outpost and I do believe this is the house of a well-known composer is a toad in the desert yeah he is that he is definitely a composer so let's just go talk to him a composer? Yes, that's me. I write songs, as you can see. Hello, hello, choo choo, wee -o. I like making songs up as I go along. Okay, how do we trigger the side quest then? I thought we were ready. Okay, do you have any more information for us? I talked to the composer guy. Oh, that final right line just jumped into my mind. Sit tight, oh plumbing knight. If the picture just won't get all stacky on me. The race is won. No, I'm done. I'm not really one to boast, but talent? I've got the most. Now to my lyrics, raise a toast. Cha-ching! Pop Devo, now we'll sing. Ah, but I'm afraid I just can't sing without any music. Yeah, you need the melody. Ooh, drat and drear, my mind wasn't clear. Lyrics aren't the only thing Pop Diva needs again to sing. Without music, it's quite clear that Diva's voice, none will hear. Hmm, what shall I do? What shall I do? Who compared my lyrics to music too? I know who. I heard the rumors that somewhere is a composer beyond compare, which I just been to. Special power as music brings. Can I help the diva sing? Mar, I'm on my knees. Won't you help me, please? Here, take this and go. Find the music, save our show. The lyrics I got and the composer I know. And we are back in the outpost. Hopefully, you're gonna write up some music for us. And Goombars is going to keep running like that. And here are some lyrics. Hmm, what's this then? Oh, well, uh, uh -huh, fantastic. These are incredible lyrics. The word is simple, yet whoever wrote them packed them with powerful feeling. It's been a long time since I was moved by something so deeply. They moved me so much, I just thought of beautiful music to accompany them. Wait just a second. Phew, I've written the perfect music for these lyrics. I caution you though, that this music can be sung only by an expert. So I'm guessing that the music is very, very advanced. I know of no one up to the task. Here, take my masterpiece. And I got the melody. Now let's give it to the master poet. 
And we're back in Toe Town. Hopefully this music will get down without a frown. Ooh, say it so, that's music, no? Yes indeed. Here's the music. Hmm. Oh yes, 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 it's the best. With this music we rejoice, or we'll give Pop Diva voice. Now Chanterelle, please do tell, will you sing this new song? Come on, come now, we can't wait long. Oh, it's perfect, so beautiful. But what if I can't sing it? Hey, hey, it'll be okay. We can do it, nothing to it. Be courageous, sing it loud. We're wrong, sweet and proud. Yeah, sing for your supper, yes, I will try to sing. Don't try to sing, do it. Ah, okay. Oh, here we go. One solo coming right up. <laughs> and the bartender brings out his guitar. Out of nowhere. Shh. And Goombar was just kind of indifferent. Bravo, marvelous! Bravo, encore, encore! Bravo, here, here. This sweet song has brought me tears. Tomorrow, our greatest thanks because of you, Pop Diva Cranks. I can sing, Lottie, I'm overjoyed. Thank you, you saved me, Mario. I wish I could do more, but here's a small gift. Please treasure it. Oh, whoa. Hmm. Changes the sound effects when Mario's attacking. So now we have the D badge, but we just need the A. I do know, I do know that Merlo has the A badge. I can't remember where the B, C, and E are. So, um... I'll have to kind of look into that, but... Anyway, as a final note to this episode, I am just going to say that if you like this episode, then please leave a like or comment. If you didn't like this video, then I can't really know what to say, except I won't give you Melody and Harmony for your pieces. And if you think I sing just wrong, then please subscribe. Ciao.